guys, what's going on? It's AJ Productions here, and today I am at the Crystal Lake Chuck E. Cheese on their very last day before they remodel to the 2.0 location. It's been confirmed. The, the pods are right over there with a giant empty dumpster. And then the cranes are right here. So it is confirmed and we had an employee confirm it to us as well. Let's go see this Studio C Alphabot. This is a Studio C Alpha. It looks to be in really good condition. Um, there is no Apple TV, I noticed. So I don't know if they just haven't had that for a while or if they just took it out. Um, you do have the parrot up here. He is still there, not moving. The lights in the back aren't on either. And it looks like there are a few cars back there. Just a couple. And then, of course, the backdrop with the buildings. Such a beautiful and unique stage. And I am so upset that I came here. Well, I don't know. It's bittersweet, right? Because I came here on the last day that this guy will be here. However, oh, and they even got the curtain. Okay, let me finish my statement. However, as much as I want to camp out and take this guy when they throw him in the dumpster, I can't. I live like five hours away from here, and my first day of college is tomorrow. I can't miss that. I'm I'm bummed. I, everything in me wants to stay and preserve everything I can. The good news is, it's not like there's a lot of artwork to preserve here. It's the base five artwork, which still, I mean, is better than what they put up now, the silhouettes. But, um, I mean, it's, it's nothing interesting, the phase five. Although, of course, the one little nod, Chuck E. Cheese's Pizza Time Theater, right there on his strap. So it looks like they do still have the curtains. They are open and they are not operational. Rachel's checking them out. Ooh, they're nice satin curtains. Nice, last time I'll probably be able to touch a Studio C Alpha curtain. You got the monitor in the middle with the Chuck E. Cheese lettering. No lights over here. The ticket blaster over here on the left side of the stage with the Avenger Chuck. And then it looks like we got some uh, party stuff over here. So really, as far as this goes, that's about it for the Alpha stage. But it's cool because I've, I haven't seen one of these since I was a little kid, you know. Fell out of love with it in like 2012 when I was a teenager. And then not until 2020, 2021 did I fall back in love with it when I brought my kids here and the, the nostalgia hit and now I'm a super fan of this. Um, yeah, first Studio C Alpha stage I've seen since. And uh, you're looking pretty good, Chuck. You are looking pretty nice. Free feet pics for Chucky. No, I just, <laughs> I just wanted to see what was under here. You never know if there's anything hiding. We do have some lights working right now. Looks like the green lights are on. We got the neon on the outside here. Those are on. We got the blues over there. On the air sign, the applause sign over there. That's about it though. You're looking good, Chuck. Hey, I'm sorry to tell you, but once they wrap up tonight, they're gonna do, do something dirty to you. And I'm really sorry about that. I wish I could stop it. Man, this hurts. This hurts. Like, I'm, I'm staring at this dude and he's moving. And it's like, ugh. Please tell me, please tell me, by some miracle, that you're not destroying this bot. I mean, I know you probably are, but please tell me by some miracle that you're not. Like, hey, I have that.
that Studio C stage and I need a bot for it. I'll take them off your hands for you. I actually, no shame, already asked them if I could take anything that they're gonna trash. As expected, they just said they couldn't do anything, so I guess it doesn't hurt to ask. They do have a very interesting um, little ramp over here that was probably when the, the walls were up. And they do have the trampolines installed here. They said they installed these earlier this year, um, but they don't have them up and running yet. Uh, we have Chucky, Bella, and Munch over there on the wall. We have the Phase 4 restroom signs, and interestingly enough, a 2.0 pickup sign. So really that's it. Um, it's a Phase 5, so there's really no artwork to show you guys. I showed you the one relevant thing, everything else is, you know, 2.0 Chuck. Um, like I said, still cooler than what we have now, the silhouettes, but not worth really going and looking at. But yeah, so this is his last day, and I wish I could do something about it, but I'll use this opportunity to talk about the, the Nanuet store real quick because I think that it's very interesting that they saved a store but didn't do anything with the bot. And there's all these rumors going around that they're going to replace the bot. I don't know what they're going to do for sure. Um, if corporate sees this per chance, please consider doing something with it. Now, I know that you saved it and, and I'm grateful that you did. And I'm grateful he's on random movements. But people manage to get their hands on these and then get them working. So if a random person can get it working in their garage, I have faith in the company that you can get, you can get it working again. So please, just for the sake of us, because I really want to see a Studio Seabot perform, and I haven't seen that since a kid. Ever since I gotten back into this fandom, uh, the only movement I see from a Studio C bot is just random movements. And I'm really excited to see this one's on random movements. I want to see them perform. These Garner Holt bots are top of the line, at least for their time, and I just think it'd be cool to see them do something. Until the meantime, all I have are videos on YouTube to watch, so. <sighs> all right, Chuck. Well, enjoy your retirement. I hope that somebody scoops you up and I'm going to spread the word because I can't be here to save you. I'm really sorry, but I hope somebody can. So, all right, Chuck, peace out. Worth noting before I leave, they have these tickets around the door, which I've never seen at any location, so that's very interesting. But anyways, Chuck, I wish you well. Anyways guys, that is it for this location. It truly is a bittersweet moment. Um, I'm thankful that I was able to come in here and see the Studio C Alpha on his last day. But, man, knowing his demise is coming. Seeing those pods over here looming in the corner and knowing what's inside of them I'm heartbroken honestly so if I'm guessing um, with the remodel comes new carpet obviously they are gonna have a new um, sign over here I, he probably will stay but they'll definitely have a new sign um, stage is going to be tearing, torn down and the phase five artwork is going to be gone. So if anybody is able to save that, I know by the time you guys see this, but this time I came prepared and I made a post on the, um, the Facebook page. So hopefully here's to praying with my one hand because my other one's holding the camera. Here's the hoping and praying that somebody comes out here and preserves this because it'd be, it'd be a damn shame if he got trashed so all right guys thank you for watching this bittersweet episode of me checking out my chuck e cheese locations and if you liked this please subscribe for more and hopefully hopefully uh we'll hopefully we'll be able to save something all right guys thanks for watching and i will see you in the next one goodbye